Why hello and thank you so much for joining me as gamers. We're jumping into Mystery Mask, the Immortal Soul. Really amazing a little story to this one too, where we, well, our tribe gets completely annihilated. We're the only one to survive and we're out and about. That looks like Thor's. <laughs> and we're out and about trying to survive. We found this mask and it's giving us some special powers or learning powers. We're going to learn a little more about the game as we go through it. Uh, there's some crafting, there's some building, and yeah, it looked absolutely amazing. The map is freaking huge. Okay. I mean, friggin huge so i'm <laughs> not sure if we'll be able to get in the water kind of like going near water but we'll probably look for some fresh water uh these are points of interest i guess we can go and visit so far there's of course a little cloud across here as we're going to venture we'll learn a little more there's some more on this side here too i would like to get to some kind of waterway i guess to get some water i think these are all precisely generated lands i'm not positive uh it sure looked like it when i kind of jumped in uh, but again, it's still very early in the build, and it's supposed to come out, I think, this year or next year. If you want to put your wish list, I'll put a link in the description down below. Thanks to devs for making it possible. Again, uh, thank you, everybody, for being here. If you enjoyed this, and you want to do hit like button, subscribe, all the wonderful things. You can actually redesign your mask and everything else. You can choose uh, male, female, and you can also uh, play solo or in multiplayer, and also PvE, I think, in PvP. So there's a lot to do in here. There's a lot of crafting of skill sets we need to go and get. I thought it looked pretty good this early on. It's not a release. This is a play test, so it's not the finished product. Uh, just in case you guys know where. There's bamboo, too. Very nice. Can I just grab bamboo? No, I need to. Oh, okay, no. All right. Well, it says on the top left, pick up some resources and branches and stuff. We're going to look on the ground for all the goodies. There's some branches or some stones and rocks. Picked up resources. Experience is going up. I like this. We're going to play a little bit. Unfortunately, it's a small play test, and I, I don't know if I have uh, enough time to do a whole thing on it, but darn it, as soon as they come out with it, I'll definitely be jumping on this, or as soon as they give us a little more leeway for us to be able to record this, I'll be back in. But I understand it's a play test. They want to kick the tires and see how people feel about it. It's always good for you to be able to jump in. I think I always like first person also. Uh, it would be kind of nice. And yeah, we're going to be okay trying this. What's this stuff here? We're picking up vines at the same time. We're also picking up poisonous bug. I don't know if that's something you want to keep, but I guess we maybe we can make some special arrows and stuff. It looks very jungle-esque. I like this. It has a uh, green hell vibe to it, but the things look really nice right now. And of course, there's also weather and stuff, supposedly, in this game too. So really early on, nicely done. I, I'm liking what I'm seeing. It looks clean. And yeah, man, I'm, I'm kind of enjoying this already, this early on. Okay, so what do we have here? We have to go and press T, and we're going to check that out here. T here, and they want us to go to Knowledge, and they say click on Bonfire. Okay, there, click and hold this. Done. All right, then we have to Basic Building. Oh, wow, look at all the stuff we're just unlocking now, the blueprints. So this is all with the points we just got right now, I think, the ability. Awareness, Strength needed one, so that is something that we can unlock really quick all right this is good uh we're gonna need primitive tools of course so we got ourselves uh ability to get water bug catcher i think and a well a waste lamp nice like that we got ourselves a pickaxe a stone axe butcher knife so obviously hunting involved and unlocks also here a little cycle 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 yeah whatever you want to say so here we need uh, tech points needed so these ones but i wonder if we can go a little further out awareness strength needed three to go to the uh, basic carpentry and stuff so we'll wait for that i'm pretty sure they're gonna make us craft up tools and stuff so right here they said what press tab and open up bar here we got bonfire we have rope and obviously it's probably gonna take rope to make no that isn't actually so yeah, wait select one. Oh, that's interesting so we have branches we can either make it with this stone pickaxe with either stone or flint okay i'm digging that so yeah oh stone okay i don't know double click that whatever in my inventory i guess once we have both it makes more sense to do that let's just double click that one and can i make this i'm gonna need do i have enough to make it i don't think i do i'll be honest with you i think i i'm gonna be running out we'll put this number four because we're like usually my pickaxe and my axe i like to have right here so we'll pick up some more rocks but we'll do it a little faster with a pickaxe we're gonna hit about three minutes of this game we'll see what it's about and yeah i mean so far i'm i'm gonna tell you i'm kind of impressed <laughs> well a little closer okay the rocks kind of just break away and we got uh some okay i like that they disappear is this something or is this like a yeah, after okay no there's still some more here and we're picking up rocks i wonder what the weight limit is on our lady here uh, okay so 6.3 of 102 that's pretty okay so let's get ourselves a knife 
Yeah, I'm going to make it with whatever I found. I think you've got both. you got Flint, too, at the same time. Beautiful. Again, I think you can select either or as you progress, so that's pretty okay. I don't know if there's, like, a better value to each and every one of these. Uh, it would last longer, but I don't know. Thatch basket, we can make one of those. Let's make one of those and have that on us so we're ready to pop that. And what else we have here? Foundations. We're going to need to chop down fiber, and we're going to need either stone or flint to make a bonfire. We're going to need thatch and thick rope. So rope is definitely important for us to make. And uh, what's some... I guess... We I can only make three. All right. So, yeah, that's all I had on me. I didn't really pick up enough stuff. Surprise! I know, right? You're like, what the hell? But I know. I think I saw mining go up. Uh, I wonder if it went up because I also picked up off the ground. I wonder if that affects or not. Or is this... Wow, it's a big old rock. We're going to need some flint. Oh, my God! <laughs> that went down really fast. Okay, so what do we uh, get from these uh, ferns here? Yeah, we got fibers and stuff here, too. Is this aloe? Yeah, it is aloe. Very nice. I mean, the plants are really nice and popping. I like that. I think there's different sizes of plants, too, and different colors a bit. Or I'm not sure if it's... Yeah, it looks like it's a little bit different, which is, you know what? Something they don't do in a lot of games. It's all the same exact. And I kind of like this. Uh, you know, if you have different kind of styles of the same plant, it looks like this one's a little bit smaller than the other one. You know, like simple things like that is really nice. We'll try and chop down a tree and see what we get from that. Obviously, I want to pick up... Okay, I don't think I want to mess around with that thorn bush at all. Pretty sure that's going to freaking hurt me. And I'm not really that interested. I'm happy we're picking up those vines. I think that's how we make the rope, right? You can do multiple uh, searches on this. Okay, it's kind of like tap it really quick. Be nice if we could hold it down. That's what I'm going to say. I know they're asking for uh, what we're thinking about this game and stuff. I should probably just try and queue it up across. Be okay. All right, so we'll pick up a bit more. We're going to try and find ourselves a water. Now, could you? Yeah, we have a shortcut there. Uh, right there it looks like a probably a good place. I mean, it looks like fresh water all the way across the map. Let's go see what this one looks like. It's close to a couple of uh, key points, uh, which would be nice. So I press V. And, okay. Oh, it actually shows up in a map. Beautiful. Okay. So, yeah, let's see what the tree looks like when I chop it down. So, yeah, the mask, I don't, I'm trying to figure out what it's a sickle I need to make now. Sorry, right. they want us to make like everything here, which is okay. I probably will get more. Oh, yes. Stupid me. Probably going to get more stuff with this, right? So, let's queue that up. Can I put this in my inventory just for now? I can. Perfect. We can leave that there. Uh, put the knife in number five. I just make a bunch of these by mistake or no okay good <laughs> i thought i made a bunch oh uh, this is when i'm moving this around as a sound of almost the crafting part all right so we have that and uh, we have let's see what else we have we can make da, 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 grass mats thatch roof so we have some different things now including thatch foundations that have been opened up we have the bonfire which is uh good we'll craft that baby up because we're gonna want it i like that it tells you what's pulling out that's cool no, we want to actually chop it down. I want to see what it looks like here. All right, we're getting some levels up. I've got to look at that, too. Gather bush uh, more. Okay, with sight. Now, the trees just go into our inventory? Oh, it did automatically. We got 11. That's pretty okay. Got better than picking up all the ground. I like that. Oh, yeah. Much better. So, yeah, who cares about the E thing? Let's get stuff out of these. There is wear and tear on these things, so we have to be careful. Boy, it's a wide range, too. Look. Oh, my God. That's so good. That's well done. All right, let's see here. Right in the middle. Wham! Okay, a little bit of stamina issues. Where's my stamina bar? Is that it there? The green one? Okay. My health is there in red, and I guess the yellow one, I don't know. Maybe food and stuff. I don't know. All right, so bonfire, flame, revival. After building a bonfire or campfire, light it once. Uh, so that's something we're going to need to do. I don't know what this stuff is. It almost looks like flax, but I don't think it is. Uh, pretty sure it's fall damage and stuff. It's supposed to be pretty... Uh, there is, like, wild animals. Is that a tappy? Those are not vicious. we got to be careful. There is wild animals in this. Insufficient stamina, yeah. Yeah, it's a tapping, isn't it? Yeah. I wonder if there's some cappies, too. Tappies and cappies. I wonder if we can get that now. I'm starting to think. Can I get this with this? Yeah. Wait. 
wild fruit. Well, that could be handy. I kind of like that idea. Stay far away from it. So as long as you have this, you're rocking this. Now we got some wild fruit on us. I'm not sure. Let's just double check. That's edible, right? You so okay, hunger, replenishes, hydration, additional, improve, uh, improves mood. So the other one probably has mood, but uh, accumulates a small amount of poison beef. <laughs> oh no, not too much of them. Okay. When you're happy, you stopped and started reading that carefully. I'm not going to shove a whole bunch of those down. Obviously, I guess hunting will probably be a good thing to have, but we need to get ourselves out there to, towards water. So any kind of water would be good. This is a cliff, isn't it? I don't think I'm going to want to jump off of this. I'm going to have to find a way around. It looks like I'll have to go lower down here, back around to the right. So far, the game is looking good. The animation, I can understand why she's running forward. Like that. <laughs> I mean... Uh, I think you guys get the point. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so there's uh, definitely a, maybe an issue why she's ready for it. But I mean, first person would be fantastic. There's some more wild animals up there. I'm not sure I want to tangle with them just for now. I don't really have any other weapons. I have this site. I'm not sure how well we can protect ourselves. Did I just eat that? If I'm a mistake, I think I might have. Yeah, maybe I did. All right. Now there's a mask we have to fix it with some green crystals I was reading too. So that's going to be interesting. I don't know what that is. It looks like there's some kind of big ruins on the left. Where are we now? We're right close to where we want to go. I'll just take a quick look so we, we can see it. And oh, there's people there, dudes. And I'm pretty sure these are baddies. I don't really want to fight and die this early. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm trying to make sure you guys can see it. Yeah, you've got a campfire and a couple scouts and people looking out there. We're going to keep that for maybe when we have a weapon. A ranged weapon would be preferable. I'm thinking because I think I saw the other guy with a bow. Looking like a spear on the other guy's back. So, you know, if I could take out one and make my way through, it would be kind of nice. So well, this looks pretty cool. I'm not sure if there's any, like, flat land for us to build on here. Oh, some water sort of... Shit is that? What is that? Oh, it's a turkey! Oh, from behind you looked horrible. See, so you looked freaking horrible, turkey. Gobble, gobble. Is a cappy? Oh, there's capybaras. That's awesome. I love freaking turkey. I want supper. It's Thanksgiving somewhere. <laughs> My stomach. If I can kill you. You don't attack back, which is a great thing. Gobble, gobble. Oh, that's a lot of hits so far, just to take this turkey. Yeah, he's a level 10. So I, I can see maybe why. Maybe we'll try a pickaxe now. Let's try a like, gold pickaxe action on him. I, I think we might have to give up and let it be for now until we get ourselves a weapon weapon. Maybe we'll stay around here. I don't know. Boy, he is tough to friggin' follow. Uh, he's getting back health, too. So yeah, we definitely need... Uh, he's regening. Which is good, I guess, for us. I don't think I could, I guess I could draw the water and drink it. I guess I have to make a, a little something, something, right? Oh, God, this is not the greatest land to build on. All right, where's another thing here? It looks like, I think these are, there's like, so it says there's like a little bit of pasture here. This looks like it's all rock face. Uh, there's possibly maybe up there. So let's try there. Because this is a, really a bad land for us to be in. Lots of turkeys, though. That would be really good food. All right, actually, right next to us, there's like a little water source here. I mean, I don't know if they're going to ever have like really flattish ground around us. But that little area over there is like okayish. But this one is probably the best one. I'm not sure if I can build on water or not. And the only way of really finding out this is to do it. Uh, either that, I can go and find myself an open area over there and be close to water. Maybe there's something in that little valley up there. Because I'm thinking, okay, this is great, but, I mean, it doesn't get too much sunlight either. I think it's none of this well because this is valley, yeah, and it's going to be dark because of these big old trees. All right, well, we'll try our best. Let's see if we can uh, construct here. Let's switch over to our trusty axe. We got some resin out of that sucker. Maybe we got some before. Oh, God, get away, get away. Okay, I'm pretty sure trees usually kill you. I'm thinking middle of that island doesn't look so freaking bad at all. Now, let's go and get uh, six. I think it's, there you go. 
clear out a little bit of the area. They're all in the middle part. The middle part looks like it's flattish. A little bit of a swim here. Yeah, it's not bad. I'm out of stamina, I guess. Yeah. All right, we'll clear out here a bit. These look like banana trees. I don't know if you got any bananas from them. They look like they're ripe and ready to go. Look like they're at the end of their life cycle. Kind of like it. I mean, it, it, I, it's okay. It's not green hell. No, I'm not saying that. But yeah, it has that uh, that green hell feel with it, uh, but runs really smooth. And I like the these you know, multiplayer, like fully multiplayer. Like a, I think it's be a large MMO if you want to, or you can just do private, which. A lot of these MMOs make such a big mistake not giving us private. Some people just prefer to play by themselves or with clothes and friends and stuff. Uh, so anyways, we'll see if we can uh, do anything here. We're getting what? Obtaining uh, branches and stuff. Nothing wrong with playing MMO too if you enjoy that. Uh, draw water. I'm going to have to draw water sooner or later. I don't know. My, okay, my stuff's on the bottom. I was like the food. Here's something surprising you don't see very often in a game. Uh, the food is not going down very fast. Neither is the water, I think. Unless I'm reading that completely wrong. Unless I'm reading that wrong. Can I see a better here? My character. Okay, well, there's a lot of stuff here, dudes. Okay, hydration. Nine cell. We're actually good. We're hydrated. And uh, we're also satisfied with the food, dudes. So that is good. Oh, man. Don't tell me someone actually doing a playtest in a game that actually has, like, you know, smart freaking water and food. Not wasting away. That's the biggest mistake they make. They release them and they just don't take the time to kind of balance those things out. It seems pretty well balanced so far, especially I've been running and everything. All right, so let's take a look at this now. We're going to have to put a bonfire down. We also need to put a thatch foundation. Start of the bonfire. Uh, we have that already on us. So uh, let's see here. It's not a very big island and make me feel shitty that I can't actually, you know, put it a shoreline. <laughs> nice and safe this way. All right, that's what they want me to do. Okay, so open this up, and they want me to turn this on, right? Open and craft. Okay. I don't have any of these here. Roasted potatoes. There's a lot of stuff in this. Okay. Uh, add fuel so we can grab maybe a stack. Now, is there splittable? Uh, Right-click? No. Alt. Right, written somewhere here. Set preferences. Repair. And encrypt. Transfer. Split S. S for split. That makes sense. So let's just give ourselves a little bit here. Since chopping down trees can't be a pain. And open a fire. There you go. So we sparked it up. I press tab and enter the crafting bar and craft a thick rope. I've already done that, but I'll do it. I made a few. There we go. So we've got thick rope done. You can also hide the guidance if you want to. Look at L. Nice. Very cool. Are you feeling warmer? All right. So I think they want us to go back in here. And find out basic weapons. Primitive fire making. I guess we can tap this. So we get ourselves a torch, I think. And primitive weapon. So there we go. We have this unlocked wooden bow, wooden hammer, wooden shield. All right. And stone. That's going to need awareness strength seven. Linen gear. I guess I can get some linen stuff going. That'd be pretty nice. Can I do basic carpentry? I can. So carpenter's table. I need to know if I can build here. Basic carpentry. So what, what is all this here? Planks, wooden handle, bed, and splints. Right over here we have a small wooden chest, so maybe I shouldn't have made the other one. So this opens up all this. Okay. We're good. And this will have to wait up for 10. All right, I'm, I'm digging this. Okay. I'm getting this. I'm understanding how it's running. I also have a tying rack here. So let's see if we can make ourselves a weapon of mass destruction. I guess we can click up here, make a life a lot easier. And wooden bow, we'll get that. And a spear, we'll make that. And arrows, where's the arrows? Could use a wooden shield, I guess, that wouldn't hurt. And spear, torch, why would you make me make that? But no arrows, it's gotta be there, there you go. Stone spear. I guess could have made that instead, right? Did I make that? What did I make here? Oh, this one's purple. Nice. I guess I got better stats in this one when I made it. Pretty cool. 
All right, so we have something pretty good. Uh, let's just see how it works on this. Sorry, Cappy. Well, was like a level three, and I, I had a hard time with it. So sorry. I mean, it's, it's the fault of the game. Oh, man. Welcome to the jungle. Okay. I think score devastated it. Oh, wow. Head trunk. Oh, wow. So we you can actually damage. Excellent. Okay. I just want to go and. Uh, can we not? Okay, wait a second. Where's my knife? Five? Am I grabbing anything from this? Do you guys see it? Uh, I grabbed some stuff. Okay, I got meats and stuff. Okay, go swing. Go swing. <laughs> We're good. All right, we'll cook that up. Yeah, there must be something here I could cook. I got meats here. Can I just shoot this in here? No. I have common trunk chunk. Common? Common trunk chunk. Uh, we got beast blood. Beast of blood. Fresh meat. So fresh meat's good. What do we have here? Missing. Fresh meat right there. Why can I do that? Uh, classification. Craft a bonfire 59 seconds. Oh, it's got to be more than that. Okay. Let's just throw this shit in here. There we go. And yeah, I got. I have the meat. Like it actually says cooked meat. So I have to put... Oh, shit. I'm such an idiot. Damn it. You just got to put it up there. Okay. Split that up here. Firm. Um, I have to do it here, I think. One second here. Split. Oh my god. Split. There we go. Confirm that sucker. Put this back in here. Alright, and that's great. So let's go and have this in there. We'll put that in there. This is gonna open up a whole bunch of stuff. I'll put the beast blood. I'm not sure what to do with that yet. As grasshoppers count, maybe they do. I have no idea. I know some people do eat those. And uh, aloe flour. I don't know. I'm just going to drop stuff to keep it nice and cool. And then we're going to cook up a bunch of meat. I guess I could just make my life a lot easier and just cook up the entire thing, right? Three cooked meat. Yeah. Which is all I have. So. Boy, that scared the bejesus out of me here. So that's maximum seven. All right. So we got the meat going. I would like to... Uh, I'm not sure if we can sleep the night out, but we can at least make some foundations and stuff. Let's see if we can start with thatch. And I'm not sure if we can upgrade it. I'm hoping we can. So, how many can I make here? Three. Metal craft, idle queue. Okay. Okay, I guess I can just bring this out here and just craft all those up. So, that's cool. So, it's going to make those foundations for me now. I've also have crates. I don't know if I can build in the water if I'm just doing this stupid and uh, not placing it properly. So,. Tell me I can build in the water. This is one of the big frustrations we could always have is not being able to do that. Okay, we can. That looks like there's a path to the right, too. So it's not wasn't a big problem. Okay, that's good. There's another one built. Thank you. Uh, am I going all the right way? I think so. Oh, I like the foundations. They look really nice, Thatch. Plus, I'm going to why not build right and see. I, I really want to play more of this game now. Kind of surprised me. Uh, you know, I, I've been so disappointed so many times. I get when you get something that actually works and it's good. You're like, wow, this is good. This is nice. So maybe we'll put one crate here. Or eh, I'm not sure yet. I don't know if we can pick these up or not. We'll find out very shortly. I'll put it right here because I don't know the distance. And was a thatch view. And can I pick this up? What does it say here? Transfer, repair, equip, uncraft. Okay, so we can uncraft this thing by going in there. Gotcha. Uh, let's see the torch how it looks because it's getting pretty dark. So, yeah, we did get a lot of resources. Nice. Wooden shield. Uh, that is the other thing we can place on us. I'm just not sure. Does that go in here somewhere? No? No. Okay. Now, uh, let's see nine. If I can put that my... If I can hold my whole stroke in, the lighting is a little bit off on it for me. But, again, we have those other ones. It's very dark. Like, it's super dark. I don't know if I could holster it somehow. It'd be really nice if I could press like G and holster it. As soon as I swap out, it's going to lose it. So, yeah. Uh, let's see how the meat's going. Then we'll check out some other things here. So, let's eat this up. This gives us what? 
Decay time stack to, okay, HP recovery 50. Recovers HP by every five seconds. Okay, what's, how's it bringing food? Satisfied 20. Okay. So let's grab that and go into our inventory here. I guess we'll have to place it here. I don't know if we can right click and just eat it. Very possible, I guess. And we'll just eat it from where we should be, right there. Shove that in my mouth. There we go. And how do I get water now? We need to get the drying rack. I bet you to get the water going, right? I did see that we unlocked it. I don't know if, there we go, water bottle. Uh, beast hide, beast hide. Okay, we did unlock. Hide, right, let's see here. What was it called? Tana rack, maybe possible. Cooking stove, carpenter table. These are all locked up and stuff. That's there, okay. Let's see here. Building. Trying to see where we can find was the splints and stuff too. My God, there's so much stuff already. And we haven't, like, these are all locked up. These are like things you have to kind of like break into. A bug net, I guess that's going to be handy afterwards. We have the waste lamp too, which is for Firefly. Oh, interesting. Fiber and think, okay, that's pretty cool. Stone blade, stone spear. Yeah, these are not, these are blades and stuff. I was looking for arrows. I'm not sure if I have to lock them afterwards or not. Or, or is this unlimited arrows? One of those games? No. <laughs> that was lackluster. I don't know. Little Cappy's like, do you know where, where my mom is? That's why I feel so bad now. I, she was delicious. Absolutely delicious. I'm so sorry. Uh, so yeah, I don't know what to do with that right now. I did unlock it recently. So let's go into T here. I don't know if this is... I still need to see like these crystals here. Green crystals need to be far from that. So I did do basic carpentry gear here like this primitive weapons and that we also had base weaving there it is a loom that's a lock now okay base grinding okay we have locked blueprints jeez there's so many things venom processing so we can't get bitten that we're going to make some serious arrows i'm not positive i'm well, surprised we can actually craft a butchering table so why not at this point I want to see what that looks like. It's going to be daylight anytime soon. I don't know. But we definitely have a table coming into processing right now, which is great. I also like to be able to put the other things there. That's foundations again. And we have all this building here. We need a water bottle. It would be nice if you like clicked on something here and it like deer hide, and beast hide. You can select which one. Oh, nice. It's either or. Oh, we actually have it, dudes. Oh. Don't I have it? Wait, I have a uh, beast hide. Okay, what am I missing too? A thick rope. Oh, that's all? Okay, well, darn, that's good. Again, if I clicked on that, I already had the stuff I can craft. It would be nice if it actually um, it gave us that option. I like to do it. Uh, yeah, just make the make it like that much. This always seems like we need it. Then we'll be able to make ourselves that thing, which means I'll be able to get some waters in my system right as soon as this is over with. Uh, the butchery table takes a lot longer than expected for that to be completed. So maybe we can just uh, get ourselves our, our friend prepared here. Oh, you're so small. I'm so sorry. Oh, you're fast. Oh, shit. You're fast. Get stuck on a rock. Get stuck on something. Oh, he's gone. It's, I have no stamina for this. Oh, unless you get stuck. Would that break my, uh, or my uh, stamina? Oh, I think I don't know sure what happened. My guy was stuck too. He wasn't like stuck, stuck, but I guess by the positioning I was in. There's like a whole ninja thing going on. I can't even see what the hell I'm doing. Oh wow, that was a critical hit, dude. Okay. So I score tap. Okay, okay, we got some stuff here. Hunting score. How do you bring the animal over? Entry. Okay, so you actually really get like a better quality with your best ever. But how do you pick this up? I want to grab him. It's fatally wounded. No kidding. Don't know how to pick things up. So that's probably going to be weird for that to happen. I'm not sure if I, like, I get 
chunks of meat that's what they're talking about and let's try my best to do this right now there's no option for me to pick up that i can see maybe you guys can correct me on that yeah the old-fashioned way choppy chops and then we will draw some water in about two seconds i don't know if i need to cook it up or not it might be some uh parasitic shit going on in here and maybe she's immune to it i have no idea but we're still going to make a bottle of water uh super important let's we'll see if we can draw the water here so we have the butchering table which is on zero and it's huge is that my girl holding on to it oh she's holding on to it okay let's put on this side here for now these are really big okay it's weird to see our own outline for that so butchery table i don't know let's just put the stuff let's say i got this stuff here so this one gives me what classification animal dk meat okay so this is for dk meat don't really want that let's like eat the meat tree bark <laughs> beast hide beast bones do we get any bones i don't think we got any bones from this guy we got some mineral colorful stone can be used uh, for trinkets interesting all right i don't know there's a fudge ton to learn i'll tell you right now okay so put that in here cook the meat and can i queue it up for six just do it once and did it go somewhere it looked like it went somewhere but i don't know where there we go and then crank that up to everything in that area i don't like it we don't be stuck in that thing that looks like possible clay over there probably check it out in a second i'm still running kind of low how much space is inside this uh, primitive one it's not horrible kind of, kind of liking that at least we have some space is there shift click yes Let's see simple things is it shift clicking or is it putting one at a time interesting yeah it's putting half at a time with a shift Let's see what happens when you control controls the whole thing okay good see these guys learn a little bit of what's going on here okay so we're good we're good we're good uh man the game is pretty solid dude so i'd like to do another day of this uh definitely interesting to see all the stuff i know it's dark right now but you know once daylight comes i'm not sure what time it is oh it shows up at midnight okay is there a bed i can make that i could actually make right now uh planks there are 10 planks so the only way to do that is a carpentry bench carpentry table and that's going to take some thick rope which we have and we need some more stone for that and logs okay stone logs so i'm pretty sure that's clay it looks like a clayish look so rock shouldn't be too hard we're getting a couple at a time not like a tremendous amount considering the size of that rock though We are getting flipped at other things, but let's just see if that's clay if I'm right. It is clay. I mean, it's a good resource to have. Don't get wrong. Just not need it right now. So there's a lot of chopping and stuff hanging up here. I'm not sure if this stuff comes back or not. It is pretty big map, though. So I figure there's tons out there. Like, this looks size of this rock right here. I should have got like a ton of loot, a ton of rocks in this one. And instead, I'm going at 29 with all the rocks i've hit that big boulder alone should be like a 20 shotter just saying personally but these are small factors considering i'm not starving and i'm gonna try the water in a second i'm not starving every two seconds not thirsty every two seconds which you know it's super appreciative already if we clear out the area we can see a whole lot better yeah i'm not sure what those fruits might be freaking me out a little bit like my water is not moving whatsoever i don't get it okay so that filled the water you can actually see the water filled up so do i need to boil this let's just double check this here where's my uh my water was in my inventory here like that let me go here let's put this down here did it open up anything no uh water bottle that quenches thirst doesn't seem to say i'm gonna get sick off it so we're gonna test it out but i'm worried about the poisonous stuff you know did that work it seems to have worked properly i'm not seeming to get sick at all which is great i'm not gonna be a farther away from the source of water with any big issues I like that a lot all right so my tool did break now here's the big thing can i just repair that can 
needs it took three flint to repair it so i guess if i selected rocks it would take my rocks instead i took the flint which is great because i you know either or uh, i just try to get as much as possible of stuff here at the same time i'm trying to get rid of these vines uh they can be annoying and nuisance in areas where you oh, get a little closer where you try to get to, uh, to stuff like the trees and other things that can't block you out from areas and i'm pretty sure they can hurt you i didn't even get close some I get what thorn is. I've already had it with my hand in real life, and uh, it was quite large. It went right through my hand when I was a kid. And uh, let me tell you something. Uh, not something you want twice in your life. So we'll see how that goes. I get cloth, master linen processing. And again, we still have some things to do on the left-hand side. And again, I'm kind of skipping because I'm looking at base building. I really like what Thash looks like in the dark. We're doing pretty good with that. We have a stamina issue still. Uh, but I figure that's going to change up as we progress and get a little better at this. But we are chopping down big old trees and stuff, right? So let's see here. Carpentry. What am I at now for this? What am I missing? I can actually craft that up. Thank you so much. We'll get that good. And then linen. What's the next one here? Linen. It said, right? Linen. And there's linen here. And where's the actual loom? It's a loom, dude. It's a L O O. There we go. We're going to be missing some planks. We still need planks anyways, and we're going to need to get ourselves some rope too, which is a good thing now. I've been kind of like doing that work. And again, we'll close it up. Got to get used to this thing. And it's only... Uh, where is it? Oh, good. That's perfect. Let's put up a, a good batch of this again. I don't want 179 vines of this, but this should be pretty good. Get 36 of those crafting. Pretty simple once you get used to the mechanics for that. We have, again, uh, tons of rocks, uh, tons of resources around us. Uh, this area here, which I'm at, I don't know if it, you know, like I said, I don't know if the maps are exactly the same, but this area here is probably the better area for it now. Uh, I'm able to build in the middle. I got water, which is fresh. Uh, my fire just went out. That's fine. It's a little bit darker. It should be. Apologize. Try and light up our portable torch, but it's, it's a shit torch. We want to do. So the carpentry bed should be completed. And we have that wooden shield too. I could put that here for now, the shield. Maybe just move this across here. And those berries too, because they're not good to eat. I'm tired of that. And once the carpentry bench is over, we should be able to make some planks and stuff. And I still have some wood left over. A couple pieces. One piece. Should be good enough. And uh, that, that does take a long time for it to get completed. Then we can actually get the rope going. Then we can make the loom. And it was just a lot of things we could do. Anyways, I wanted to kick the first 30 minutes. I think the game it looks really great. I love the map size of this. I uh, love that there is POIs. They're marked around here. So maybe, you know, better than stumbling in. Uh, overall, I think, you know, the water and food are well adjusted. They're really nice. Uh, the food has gone down since last time we had it. But that's good. What's this upgrading wood? Because oh, I, I made that. That's pretty cool. And there we go. Oh, my God. It's freaking huge, dudes. Oh, wow. Maybe outside went better, right? Yeah. We got planks and other things we can make through this. Wood handles. Wow. Planks. Beautiful stuff. Anyways, uh, we'll craft. Let this craft up. Again, we're going to be inside. I'm not sure. Let's just go back out. One, 12 seconds. Let's stop here. Am I still quite this? So I think we'd be inside this one. It's crafting. I'm not positive, but it looks like it might be at least close to it was happening anyways uh decaying too we have dk time do you see that so we'll have to be careful of that it means we'll have to cover this stuff up too anyways pretty cool game i love it i hope you guys are enjoying it too if you are please take time hit like button subscribe if you want to see a little more i'll try to kick it as long as i can before the uh well the play test is over i wish it was a lot longer than it is but i can understand devs need to get back to work need to figure out so i was hoping i'll be able to showcase some things i'm thinking about uh these things look absolutely spectacular by the way i love the way they look yeah, everything looks clean not anything i've seen before so it looks like they might have made their own which is great unless someone's going to tell me something different but it looks nice the area looks beautiful and yeah i'm super excited to go and venture out and learn a little more about this anyways thanks for being here thanks for being amazing you guys are the best this game and i'll catch you guys on the flip side mm -hmm.